We're asked to determine the derivative function, then determine the equation of the tangent line at the point pi comma negative four pi times e to the power of pi. Notice the function f of x is a product of three functions of x, and therefore we'll have to apply the product rule within the product rule. Let's let the first function be four x e to the x, and let the second function be secant x. So we'll let u equal four x e to the x, and v equal secant x. And now applying the product rule, f prime of x is equal to the first function of four x e to the x times the derivative of the second function, which is the derivative of secant x with respect to x, and then plus the second function of secant x times the derivative of the first function, which is the derivative of four x e to the x with respect to x. So notice how to find this derivative. We will have to apply the product rule again. So for the next step, we have f prime of x equals four x e to the x times the derivative of secant x, which is equal to secant x tangent x. And then we have plus secant x times the derivative of four x e to the x. And again, here we have to apply the product rule where the first function is going to be four x and the second function is going to be e to the x. So the derivative is equal to the first function of four x times the derivative of e to the x with respect to x, which is e to the x, plus the second function of e to the x times the derivative of the first function, which is the derivative of four x with respect to x, which is four. And now we need to simplify. We have f prime of x equals four x e to the x secant x tangent x plus distributing we have four x e to the x secant x and then plus four e to the x secant x. Let's go ahead and factor out the greatest common factor Notice all three products have a factor of four, a factor of e to the x, and a factor of secant x. We can write f prime of x as f prime of x equals four e to the x secant x, and then times the quantity x tangent x plus x plus one. Notice if we distribute, we still have the same expression. So this is the first part of the question. We found the derivative function. And now from here, we want to determine the equation of the tangent line at the point pi comma negative four pi times e to the power of pi. So we need to find the slope of the tangent line by evaluating the derivative function at x equals pi. So f prime of pi is equal to four e to the pi times secant pi times the quantity pi times tangent pi plus pi plus one. Now we need to find the value of secant pi and tangent pi. Secant pi is equal to negative one and tangent pi is equal to zero. Let's verify this on the unit circle. On the unit circle, secant theta is equal to one divided by x. The terminal side of pi radians intersects the unit circle at the point negative one, zero. The secant function value is one divided by negative one or negative one. And tangent theta is equal to y divided by x, which gives us zero divided by negative one, which is zero. This gives us four times e to the pi times negative one times the quantity pi times zero plus pi plus one. Simplifying, we have negative four e to the pi times the quantity pi plus one. So this is the slope of the tangent line at the given point. So now we can find the equation of the tangent line using the slope and the point using point slope form. So let's go ahead and do that. Remember point slope form is y minus y one equals m times the quantity x minus x one, where in our case, x one comma y one is the given point and the slope is the derivative function value. So we have y minus the y value of negative 
4 pi times e to the power of pi equals the slope of negative 4 e to the pi times the quantity pi plus 1 times the quantity x minus x1, which gives us x minus pi. Leaving this in point slope form, we have the equation y plus 4 pi e to the pi equals negative 4 e to the pi times the quantity pi plus 1 times the quantity x minus pi. Now if we did want to solve for y, we would simply subtract 4 pi e to the pi on both sides of the equation. And I'll go ahead and show that as well. Solving for y, we would have y equals negative 4 e to the pi times the quantity pi plus 1 times the quantity x minus pi and then minus 4 pi times e to the power of pi. Either form of the linear equation is the equation of the tangent line. And let's verify this graphically. In blue we have the graph of the given function. The point pi comma negative 4 pi times e to the power of pi is this red point and we just found the equation of this red line, the tangent line, which we can see is tangent to the curve at the given point. I hope you found this helpful.